season six, episode 43, the comet. Oh, freak. Okay. Season finale right here, by the way. Oh, this is going to be big. Yep. Picking up a right. Yep. There it is. Uh huh. Yep. 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 Um. Yeah, what are they gonna do? Fin sword. This is Thorn. What? What Thorn? Huh? Did I miss something? All right, that must have hurt. Like, ugh, like pulling on your hand like that. It's... Oh. So he's fully transforming to Orgalord to go consume it. Okay. Whoa, that's cool. Yes, yeah, Glob still alive? Well, what the heck are you doing? Wait, no, Glob's dead. Sorry. It was just time to come out again. Glob KOing himself. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. And a ship to carry me out of this planet's gravity. Okay, so the okay. So is he going to stop the comet thing cuz Glob couldn't? These are doorways the universe presented to me. I'm pretty sure I can take you, bro. Um, I don't know about that one. Knowledge. Well, yep, there you go. Oh, and he can't stretch because he's in a spacesuit. Nope, I was gonna say, like, the, it's sealed airtight so you don't die. Whoa. I really like this. I r really like the vibe right now. Just being in, s like, I don't know, this song and being in space, it's like such a vibe. I really like that. I was not expecting the episode to take place in space like this, but this is cool. Hey, Martin. This is so crazy, Finn. What are you doing out here? Floating in my grave. Hurry up and save me. Can't, buddy. This baby does what it wants. You know what? Mm hmm. Wait, I have an idea. Really? This is almost like destiny. Like, it's supposed to happen, especially with him and his father having a connection to the comet in the first place. I don't know. Like, this it's bound to be. Here, grab on this. It's all, it really is like fate. Cool. You got gloves on. Oh, yeah. That is gross. Yeah. I'm glad Martin actually saved him. I didn't think he would care enough to. Orgalorg. Is the moth supposed to intervene? I didn't think this moth would be so significant. Oh, he knows him. Yeah, what do you think? I'm a dumb brick. Yes, kind of. Oh. Snaps, he ate the comet. Screw that. I'm going to use these hands to sock him in the chops. Hey, let's go, Finn. Oh, frick. I want to see what this comet is. Is it just a rock? Ooh, that's got to be painful. Ah, 
Oh boy. Grass sword. Oh, his grass sword is back. Wait, what? That was so easy. Wait, so he has Grass Sword back? When did he even get that thorn in his hand? And then it got mutated. I, I'm so confused. Oh. Ben, do you remember? Oh. Yeah, I, I think so. A remember? A past life? Uh-huh. Whoa. This is your crisis. So much is happening. Yep. It's literally a recap. This, look, literally, this is a recap, but not only the season, the whole show. Who knew all this stuff was so significant? Like Boom Boom Mountain right here. Interesting. So he's going to be left with a choice. To either be like a higher being almost. Or to go back to his life back on Ooh. I like this. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like you'd want to go back. Yeah. Hey, how about I get a new mode? No, you don't deserve it. Are you seriously trying to bail out again? Listen, Ben, no answer I give you will be satisfying. Besides, it was like 40 years ago. I'm 16. I don't have a star to revolve around and track time. But why do you always run from everything? When you burn enough bridges, the only direction to move is forward. Hmm. Well, there ain't no change in you, I guess. Well, I'm hmm. glad we finally understand. He's just kind of come to terms with it. I like that. He, they actually took Martin. Hey, Jake. Oh, hey! Let's go. Yeah. The universe... So Orga Orga is not dead. I... Oh, we're we just going back to Gunther. Oh, wait, his arm is normal again. Wait, what? Okay. What an interesting episode. It actually concluded itself. Most finales just end on cliffhangers that lead into the next season. This concluded itself. So, Finn obviously has had, has been reincarnated many times. He was a comet that came to Ooh, right? He, you could even call him the original. And so he was given a choice by this higher being, a power of this comet, to see the beginning and the end, like to. A pretty much ascend to a greater level of existence or to go back to Ooh, and he chose to go back to Ooh, which I mean I figured he would which I think is the right decision but what I'm what's interesting is I didn't think it would take Martin just because it's his father you know what I mean so what's gonna happen are we ever gonna see Martin again or is that just it he's just a higher being of existence now because I wouldn't be surprised if we'd never see him because Finn just got closure like, this legitimately was closure. Like, there's nothing left to tell about Martin, really. Like, Finn, like, has been mad at him this whole time, but then he just realizes, like, there's no changing you. I'm not going to be able to change you. And then they, f he's like, Martin's like, I'm glad we finally understand each other, and then poof, he's off. So, I think 
given the closure Finn received, I don't think we're ever going to see Martin again. There, there's a chance we could, but I wouldn't be surprised if we didn't. Um, but I really like the idea of the comet being not only just a destructive path, but like a higher being of intelligence almost. It, it kind of reminds me of 2001 A Space Odyssey. Like, it, the comet is almost like a representation of the monolith, right? The monolith is the next step in human evolution, and every time one shows up, there's another step in evolution, uh, eventually becoming a higher being, a power. I I find that... I find there to be parallels with that, and I, I don't know, I find it very interesting. And Finn being a comet once before in one of his past incarnations, it just provides a neat connection to the comet that he and his father have, I suppose. Um, the only thing I was a little let down by in this was Orgelorg. <laughs> he didn't do anything, really. I mean, he was cool. He just kind of vibed, but we just kind of took care of him so quick. I'm so confused about the whole, like, thorn thing in the hand, and then he got stabbed and turned into grass sword. But then when we got back to Earth, he didn't have grass sword anymore. Like, I I don't know. There's probably some very neat t storytelling there that I just completely overlooked. But that's the only thing I'm really confused about. But I just think for a season finale, I like that this didn't, even though this had cataclysmic um, or had the potential to be have cataclysmic, um, you know, consequences, like a freaking comet coming to hit ooh and stuff and Orgelorg and this huge fight and stuff, even though all of that had potential to be that way, I'm glad the season finale took itself slow. Like, sure, all that stuff could have happened, but we didn't have, like, a huge massive fight or anything, really. This was just... less action and more, like... Um, like, the writing was just... perfect. Like, you know what I mean? Like, it took itself slow, and I really appreciate that for a season finale because it usually gets so chaotic. But this one didn't. Well, then again, I, I say that usually, but the last season finale was not chaotic either. Not really. And the last season finale is when we found out about Finn's dad, right? So, and that's actually kind of interesting. So we found out Finn's dad exists at the end of the last season finale. And now this season finale, Finn's dad is gone. Like, it, it's wrapped that up. It's very poetic that... From season finale to the next season finale, we've told that whole story with Martin. At least that's what it seems like. I don't know. This was very well done. Very good for characters. Very well written. Uh, and like the last season finale, this felt more like a Finn solo event. Like this was all about Finn. And I really like that. The episodes that are all about Finn are usually the best episodes. This was very good. This was very, very good. And it didn't end on a cliffhanger, which means we can really just start season seven starting it, you know? Like, there's a nothing left open ended from this, really, except Gunther, I guess. Like, Orgoy came back down, and he got defeated by Finn, and now he's just back into Gunther, so is he just going to be Gunther again? Like, I, I don't understand that. But I'm, I'm probably not supposed to, not yet. But, yeah, this was so good. This is really good. I really like this. And now we're done with that. We're on to season seven now, man. The show's going to be over sooner than later. It'll be a sad day when that happens. But, um, yeah. All right. Well, hope you enjoyed. And uh, I'll see you guys in season seven. Bye-bye.